It's ranting time. Thank you so much for joining me for Random Rants. This time, I'm going to rant to you about something that I think that's getting way out of hand. It's been out of hand for years. I'm talking about gaming consoles. Okay? Gaming consoles. I'm talking about PS4. I'm talking about the Xbox One. I'm talking about the PS3, the Xbox 360, the Xbox, uh, the PS2, all the way back to the Atari. First off, let me just say that I understand, you know, that graphically stuff gets, you know, old and it has to be upgraded. But every five to seven years, Sony and Microsoft or Nintendo want to just shell out, make you shell out three, four, five hundred dollars for new gaming consoles. I'm sorry. But I think it's getting way out of hand. I mean, I think that, you know, games, you know, are actually, you know, when it comes to gaming, I think that it's uh, highly overrated uh, in aspects that, you know, you look back at the old Atari and what the old Atari had, uh, the 2600, uh, the 7800, I believe it was. Anyway, you take a look at it and you take a look at what it all uh Excuse me. What it all had to, you know, come about. Uh, and how things went from there to the regular Nintendo, to the Sega, the Sega Genesis, the Sega Saturns, the Sega CDs, the 32Xs, or whatever. Everything graphically changes. It's getting to the point now where, you know, the PS3 came out in 2007, 2008, I believe it was. Somewhere in that area. Maybe it was 2006. I bought a PS3 back in about 2010, 2011. Madden 25. Up there, see it? Madden, Madden 25. NFL Head Coach 09. And the PC version of uh, NFL Head Coach. I got the PS2 version of that as well. I'm a big sports gamer. I love WWE gaming as well. I love the, you know, EA brings out games. EA is glitchy. They have problems. But anyway... I don't understand, you know, graphically, when another gaming console comes out, they step up the graphics, they step up things, and they act like they couldn't put anything into the other console that they put into this new console. Oh, it wasn't, uh, uh, it never actually was, you know, we couldn't do that to this system, but we can do it to this one. In 2017 or 2020, the PS5 and the Xbox 2 comes out. I'm sorry, I don't want to sit there and just, you know, I know some people, it's not about a money issue, you know, it's not about money issue. What it's about is how, you know, it's not about a money issue, you know, as a gamer, it's about a money issue as a programmer. Sony and uh, Microsoft will do whatever they can to shut, make you shut more money for that. I'm sorry, all the old school games, the Mario's, the... Uh, Donkey Kongs, the Dig Dugs, the Froggers, the Pac-Mans, all those games paved the way for what gaming is today. And it's going to get to the point where you're going to be playing a game and it's going to be looking like real life. Really? Really? I'm sorry. I don't understand this at all. Maybe, you know, this is something that, you know, I'm sure I'm probably good once this is actually posted and everything and uh, on YouTube and stuff like that, I'm going to get... Uh, all kinds of backlash and stuff like this. But I'm an old school gamer, people. Old Nintendo. I got old Nintendo games. You know, love the Marios. Mario, Mario 2, Mario 3, All-Stars, Mario World, you know, Yoshi, all that stuff. Love the old games, you know. And I'd rather stick to playing the PS3 uh, games there. You know, Madden and uh, NFL Head Coach and, uh, you know, stuff like that. I'd rather stick to playing the old school games. I refuse to upgrade to another console. And my kids want a Wii U. Maybe I'll get a Wii U. I don't know. Maybe I'll get a PS4. I don't know. That's just me. 
I don't know, but I'd rather stick to the PS3 for now because I'm getting enjoyment out of that as you know as much as I did now that you know when I first bought it. I got an old uh, system that plays uh, you know the old uh, Nintendo, Super Nintendo, and Sega Genesis games. All about old school. Old school is highly, highly, highly forgotten. People like new and improved. You ought to like old school because it's paved the way for what's new and improved. I'm sorry, I don't understand why they have to come up with new consoles every five to seven years. It's just something that's got out of hand and it's really starting to irritate the holy crap out of me. And uh, maybe you agree with me. Maybe, you know, you're an old school gamer and you quite agree with this. You know, it's not about all this uh, hype and everything that's uh, all set, you know, what it's supposed to be. Maybe you uh, think that I'm uh, an idiot or whatever. But that's just my personal opinion. Thank you so much for joining me for Random Rants. Join me next time when I'll be ranting again.